Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through interfacing process of Prolog. So, queries are also called as goals, guys. Queries is nothing but the question may be true or false. What the query is that may be true or false. So, that is indirectly it is a goal, right? So, if a goal is a compound proportion, each of the fact is a sub goal. Got it? Fine. So, to prove a goal is true, must find the chain of interfacing rules and or facts for a goal Q. So, if we have a interfacing or a goal, we need to check each and every proportion according to that chain. So, if everything is true, then the final result will be true like that. So, I hope everyone got a small idea now. So, let us take a small example. So, if B is defined A and C is defined B and Q, we are, this is the left hand side, this is the right hand side. So, we are checking the conditions. So, process of proving a sub goal called matching satisfying or resolution. So this is all about this guys. So now let us go through types of approach in Prolog. So there is a bottom up resolution that is forward chaining and there is also top down resolution that is backward chaining. So basically the backward chaining is followed by Prolog guys. So Prolog implements use of black backward chaining. Fine. So what are sub goals? Sub goals has more than one goal can be used either. Fine. More than one goal will be using either. Fine. So, there are two ways to solve sub goals. This, those are deep first search and breadth first search. DFS and BFS orders, guys. We have already discussed them. Fine. Further moving on backward tracking. So, backward tracking is one of the concept of Prolog, guys. So, these are used in sub goals basically. So, with a goal, with multiple sub goals, if fail to show the truth or truth of one sub goal reconsidering the previous sub goal to find the alternative solution with backtracking okay so i think you got a small idea so let us assume that there are n number of goals so let's give me a second goal one two three four so the first goal is completed so it is true okay then reconsidering the previous goal to find okay then goal two is also correct but unfortunately goal three we got some error or some kind of wrong so we will be going to the previous goal guys and we will be searching for some alternate method to go to goal 4 or some, some other method. So this is what we call as backtracking. So you can move back and forward in terms of goals. Okay. So begin search when previous search left out. Fine. So can take lots of time as it is going back and forward, back and forward. If there is a huge error, it moves like that only continuously for a long period of time until it is rectified. And space becomes as the possibility of proofs to every goal. So now I hope everyone got a small idea. So now let us go through simple arithmetics in Prolog. So Prolog supports integer variables and integer arithmetics. Yeah, most of the language supports that guys. So operators are nothing but it takes an arithmetic expression as right operand and variable as left operand. So A is B by 17 plus C. This is an arithmetic or simple expression, simple arithmetic expression. So now I hope everyone got a small idea. So further continuing, not the same as the assignment operator. So are you seeing any equal to here guys? I think I'm not seeing it. It indirectly means equal to, but A is, it is just in terms of word. So we are not having any kind of assignment operators in Prolog. Further moving on, trace. Trace are nothing but the things that we do guys. Basically while that is nothing but functional callings. So call, go, other. So go to some other location and do that thing. So exit is nothing but exit from that particular goal. Redo is nothing but redo the goal again which you have just completed. Fail. When goal fails, we will be getting this fail. So now I hope everyone got a small idea on this. So in the next tutorial, we'll be going through Prolog itself and we will be covering the list structures in Prolog. Thank you. Thanks for watching.